But good morning, everybody. We're at the gym and we're doing back day. And I already did my warm up set. I'm going to start with lat pull downs. And I'm going to do two sets of lat pull downs. And then we're going to do something else. So basically, it's really cold in here today. I'm literally freezing and I fell asleep in the bathroom. I was in the bathroom and I was so tired. It's like six and I got here at like 5 30. So I fell asleep. Moral of the story. Let's just get this set in so I don't have to be here all freaking day. <laughs> when I do really good form, flat pull downs are literally the best. If you can get the form on it, like perfect, flat pull downs are amazing. But that's the hard part, getting really good form on it. I don't really care too much about, like, I don't know, when people come in, they're like, your form's bad. I'm like, ugh, just stop judging me. All you want to do is judge and just tell me that your form's better than mine. I don't care. So I'm not going to listen. Duh. I don't know. I'm, maybe I'm just an angry person. Who said I'm so we're just gonna go into low rows now so i'm gonna go like over there it's literally right across the way so here we are i only do it this attachment it's the only attachment that i like to use so real quick just can i give you guys my opinion on something i think a lot of people they like to say like oh like why do these women care about what they wear so much and I'll give you the answer. Dude, why would somebody want to look ugly ever? Can we, like, take a step back and think about that? Like, why would anybody ever want to look ugly? What? Like, but if you're like me, and all you do in your entire day is basically, like, your only public thing is go to work in the gym, I would rather just look good the one time of the day. After. And look at I don't look good. I just, I don't even have makeup on. But my outfit needs to look good. I don't see anything wrong with that. What? You said number one. What's the kind of dog that loves to find a way to slide? I think I'm going to go. You might know that. I don't Now we're going to jump over rows, and I'll see you guys over there. I know what you guys are thinking. Sheba, why do you do the exact same workout literally every single back day? Because I have found over the year of working out that these are the back workouts that I can, like, feel and that I enjoy. So I'm going to keep doing that. I mean, like, why fix it's not broken? Today's going to be a little different because I'm going to hit rare delts. I'm going to do those off camera just because, but... I mean, for the most part, if I like it, I'm going to do it. And I don't care. I don't even care. If somebody, if a scientist, a gym scientist came up to me and said, oh, factually, if you hear these workouts, they will not work. I'm still going to do it. Still going to do it. Because I don't care if it's not optimal. I just like it. I do what I like, and that's it. So many people have control issues and feel out of control of over their own lives. They don't want to admit that they don't have control over the future of their lives. Since they are so out of control, they want to control everybody else's. And I'm sorry, but I'm not going to do what you tell me to. Here's the first set. We're going to do four. Here's the first set. We're going to do four. Whenever back day lands after a leg day, um, not a glute day, a leg day. I always get the craziest back pain. I'm thinking of starting a different split. I saw a video and it was like, this. it was a wellness girl and she said about her split for wellness. And if I were to ever body build, I think I'll either do wellness or bikini. I really don't know. But um, I would like to try and work towards that. I like to take advice from people who are more successful than me. I don't like to take advice from people who just 
like, I don't know who you are. I don't know what you do. I don't know where you came from. I don't know what you look like. I didn't take advice from you just because you told me to. I don't know who you are. You're set in my jail. You guys should think the same thing as well. It hits me in the stump, which hurts really bad. And she goes, we have to do redo the pump video because you literally couldn't see my muscles in that whole thing. So here we go. Starting off with the back. Starting off with the back. That's really all we're doing. This is something I noticed. You can start to see this muscle right here. What's well, my delt, but you can actually see my delt. I hold my breath when I pose. Right, hopefully now you're going to be able to see the lat spread. <laughs> okay, so I have the urge to learn horse with no name on the guitars. So you guys are going to come along with me back to my apartment. And we're gonna learn it together. All right, goodbye, I'll see you there. Before we start, I need to show you guys my tomato plants. So here they are. Um, let me see if it's a good angle. I'm gonna probably water them right now, but look at them. They're like thriving. Look at this guy right here. He has three leaves. And then over here, I have some, um, just some flowers. This is my patio, by the way. So, yesterday, kind of my goal in life right now is to just kick phone addiction. Because, I mean, I grew up in a time where social media was new, but my addiction to social media and just mindlessly scrolling has gotten like severely bad since I graduated high school. So, in the past like three or four years. So I, I don't want to live like that. I don't want to live like brain rot and like brain dead. I want to experience life and everything around me. And I love music so much. I love it with all my heart. I have been making songs since I was 14. I've been singing since I was like two. You can ask my mom. I just love music and I am not the best at guitar yet. I've been playing guitar since I was 16. I'm great at strumming. I'm great at figuring out chords. Great at plucking, but bar chords I have avidly avoided since I started playing guitar because my fingers are like so small. They're not very long because I'm five foot two. So barring chords is just extremely hard for me. So we are gonna learn Chords of No Name. And I'm just gonna let you guys watch me. I mean, I hope it encourages you guys to work on any hobby that you have. Just put the phone down, set it on for 30 minutes and just do nothing besides what you love. And I mean, like, if you like to draw, draw. If you like to read, read. That's what I've been doing. Like, in, if I have the urge to mindlessly scroll, I've been reading instead. And I used to love books when I was little. I wanted to be an author my whole life until books kind of fell off. So I was like, content creating. You know? All right, so I'm just gonna look up a video because obviously it's not bad to go on your phone for knowledge. All right. I'm just gonna start. I'm assuming the strumming pattern on this is gonna be really hard. Okay, apparently this is like one of the easiest songs to play on the guitar. So, <laughs> I just love this song. This song is quite literally my favorite song. I listen to it all the time. So the urge to know how to play it and sing it is like so strong. Or the E minor, and that kind of cheater version, the second chord, is just the second fret on the G string. So if you were a beginner, so that's like kind of a cheat, cheating way to do it. Now, I have a way, since it's more than one guitar and it's not doing the same thing over and over, this is how I would play it if I Now, what is that chord that he's playing?
<sighs> My back hurts from slouching. I don't know if you guys have ever watched Bojack Horseman, but that's like literally one of the, I think it is my favorite show of all time. It's on Netflix. And I love the cover of Horse of No Name on that um, show, which is why I'm doing this. My puppy keeps eating the sticks off the ground. They're the first part of the Oh, let me re say that. I already messed it up. But it's okay. Calm down. That's not right. Keep a second for it, maybe? I'm doing Mariner's Apartment Complex by Lana Del Rey. There we go. That's a work in progress, but I love playing it music to my ears. it like the right tempo. Ow, my nail. That always happens. That was better. My nail always like cracks on the on the guitar. Cracks so bad. new chords that I just recently learned so that's why it sounds kind of crazy much for watching I have to edit this video now so I'm gonna edit probably inside because I need to charge my computer do one of your hobbies today do it I'll see you tomorrow